Hello everyone, welcome back to my YouTube channel, and I know it's been a long time since I've done a video, but that was because I was transitioning from interest from the trash pack to roller coasters. So, I thought a, the, a perfect roller coaster video to start with is my top 10 roller coasters. Now you will notice that a lot of these are from the same park, but that is because these all of these are my home parks, so... And I don't get to other states and that kind of thing too often. So that is why they're from the same parks a lot. But let's get started. Number 10 is Viper at Six Flags Magic Mountain. And this has a very good layout. It has seven inversions, which is a lot. It goes 70 miles per hour, which is pretty fast for going upside down. But the problem is it bangs your head around quite a bit. So... That is why it's only number 10, but if it was smoother, it would get a lot higher. So, number 9 is Apocalypse, also at Six Flags Magic Mountain. This is a wooden roller coaster. It is very twisty, which is really cool. Um, it's not crazy intense. It has a lot of tunnels. There's fire that goes off. And it's a very fun ride. Um... Probably one of the best wooden coasters I've been on, and it's a, I, it's a good ride. Um, number eight is another wooden coaster. It's Timberhawk Ride of Prey. This is at Wild Wave Theme Park, and it's a good ride. It feels a little like Apocalypse, but it's smoother than Apocalypse, which is why it's ahead. The only problem with it is it's kind of short, so... That's the only problem with it. But other than that, it's great. Okay. Number seven is Silver Bullet at Knott's Berry Farm. So, this is an inverted coaster, which means your feet dangle below the track. It has six inversions. All of the inversions are very fun. It is pretty intense, especially the last helix. Um, I actually lost color vision on the last helix. Um, don't make that be, make you, don't that, don't let that scare you to ride this one because it's perfectly safe. It happens sometimes. Um, it's very underrated too. People say it's not a great ride, but I don't think that. So that's why it's number seven. Number six is Superman Escape from Krypton at Six Flags Magic Mountain again. And this is the tallest, fastest roller coaster I've ever been on. So basically what it does is it launches you backwards to 100 miles per hour, and then you go straight up 415 feet, and you get to look down that uh, 400 feet, which is super awesome, and then you come flying straight down back to Earth. And it's a very, very short ride, but a lot of roller coasters are short rides, but it's very fun, and I would definitely recommend it if you're at Six Flags Magic Mountain. So, yeah. Number five is another coaster at Six Flags Magic Mountain. It is Batman the Ride. This is another inverted coaster, but this one is so intense. You are four times the force of gravity the entire ride. ride. It is crazy, and it's awesome. Number four is the Riddler's Revenge, also at Six Flags Magic Mountain. This is a stand-up roller coaster. So you, you kind of straddle a bicycle seat, so it's not really standing, but it kind of is standing. It has six inversions, 65 miles per hour. It's a very long ride, which is really good. It's about equal intensity as Batman, and I it's a very good ride. Number three is Elso at Six Flags Magic Mountain. It is full throttle. This is a launch roller coaster it has the world's tallest loop which is 160 feet tall and you are hanging off your lap bar at the top of the loop it is crazy this roller coaster also includes three launches including a reverse launch this ride is phenomenal number two is accelerator at Knott's Berry Farm as you can see by the picture it is very fast and more than speed, though, it gets to that speed in an insanely short amount of time. You, it, you go 82 miles per hour in only 2.3 seconds. 
It is amazing. And then you go straight up 200 feet. You go straight down 200 feet. You do a few other things, and then the ride is over. So it's a short ride, but it's awesome. And we get to number one, which is Twisted Colossus at Six Flags Magic Mountain. Um, this ride opened this year in April, and I got to ride it nine times. Look at the first drop. It is straight down, and as you realize, it looks like steel track on a wood structure, and that's what it is. It is a hybrid roller coaster, which means steel track on wood structure. It has some crazy airtime. That first hill that you can see after the drop is the most intense part of the ride. It's crazy. There's also, it's racing too. As there's, so there's two tracks running up against each other. And there's actually a point of ride where you go, point on the ride where you go sideways. Where, so you're facing each other. So it's kind of like you can high five. You actually can't though because it would be unsafe if you actually high five. Um, it has two inversions awesome ride it's the world's longest hybrid it's actually four minutes long which is crazy so yeah this is a phenomenal ride 10 out of 10 awesome so i hope you enjoyed my video today and i will be posting a lot more roller coaster videos soon um in probably about a week and i'll see you next time bye